The International Court of Justice has ordered Japan to halt whaling in the Antarctic. The court took away special permits that allow Japan to kill around 850 mink whales a year. Japan says it kills whales for scientific research, but the court says the scientific knowledge gained was modest in comparison with the numbers killed. Just two research papers have been published since 2005. Most of the whales killed are butchered for meat. It's considered a delicacy in Japan. Top scientists have issued an alarming report about climate change. They say its effects are already being felt in rising sea levels, melting ice caps, and more devastating weather events like drought and typhoons. Uh, we have reasons to believe that if the world doesn't do anything about mitigating the emissions of greenhouse gases and the extent of climate change continues to increase, then the very social stability of human systems could be at stake. The report predicts that more than 300 million people may see their lives dramatically affected. Populous Asian countries like the Philippines and Bangladesh are likely to face more floods. Rising sea levels will inundate low-lying Pacific islands. South Korea exchanged rocket and artillery fire with North Korea in the Yellow Sea. North said it was testing its defenses. Some of its shells landed within the South's boundaries. It replied with a barrage of its own. Seoul said the North was testing the South's determination to defend its maritime border. Meantime, a large U.S. South drill involving mock landings on beaches began over the weekend. The North always views these exercises with alarm. Catch Link Asia every Friday, 9.30 p.m. Eastern, 6.30 p.m. Pacific on Link TV.